My name is Lisa Parr. I use biometric sensors, like heart rate monitors, and brainwave devices to create interactive installations and do performances. Blooming is a interactive installation based on the interactions between the audience members by measuring their conductivity, their gestures, and heartbeats. The tree starts to bloom or it releases the petals to the ground. So this tree becomes like a metaphor for the audience members' physical interactions to create this deep sense of connection. We have three plates where up to three people can stand. When people touch each other, then we can sense whether they are holding the hands or whether they are hugging each other. I think as an artist, you come up with this like idea and then whether it's feasible or not, I started sharing those ideas with them and then they helped me a lot in terms of trimming those ideas in terms of the technical implementation. When you suggest something, they may not immediately see it. Uh, but the, when you build something uh, as a sort of a demonstrate certain technology, then they get very excited. Having the engineers, most importantly, they were really excited about my project. And it's like just like having a conversation with friends. With Gang, we mainly focus on creating some resistive and capacitive sensor, which is able to measure the conductivity, the electrical field between the audience members when they have a skin-to-skin -skin contact. The hardware that I use uh, is also being used for my other projects at Bell Labs. And also, in my spare time, I like to build various different sensors, so it's also my hobby. So it was a lot of trial and error, but I think that process has been a lot easier because they've been giving me some feedback based on their experience. So it kind of saved my time and also their input was fruitful for making a decision on what the installation structure should be. And I really feel thankful for their time and for their help. Working with artists, I had a preconception that they, they are some weird people. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I, after working with Lisa, I changed my mind. Working with artists does make me think of my own work in a uh, very different way.